Good morning, it's Saturday, live with Dr. JJ from the Adam Care Prayer Corner. A reading from John 21. Peter felt hurt because he said to him the third time, Do you love me? And he said to him, Lord, you know everything, you know that I love you. And Jesus said to him, Feed my sheep. When we feel hurt, it's time to mend the deep wounds, time to recover and restore. Of course, we have to open eyes to see, and it's notable that only one of the disciples recognizes Jesus on the shore. All of them see the Lord, but only one of them, the beloved disciple, who reclined at Jesus' breast the Last Supper, recognized the Lord. The pastoral implications of this are potentially enormous. Could it be that the reclining with Jesus, spending tender time with the Lord in prayer, and resting our mind and his heart and breast, could it be that such quiet immenseness, immersions of ourselves in the presence of God, are the key to recognizing God in our daily lives and ordinary routine? Could it be that our more imp impertuous incl inclinations, wanting to build three booths on the Mount of Transfigurations, or needing to go fishing just to keep busy, could it be that the that our need to stay on the move and remain productive instead of wasting time with God in prayer? often keeps us from recognizing the presence of the Lord in our day to red lives. Are we making time for quiet prayer? Or is it hard for us to do to step off the treadmill of our busy life to simply rest in God's presence? Take 10 minutes for prayer today. And God, we seek the wisdom that comes from spending time alone with you. Teach us to recline with Jesus so as to recognize your presence more clearly. Amen.